He was once the controversial head of the radio network that would challenge Rush Limbaugh on the conservative radio. Today, in a Honolulu courtroom, he was sentenced for theft. KITV's Daryl Huff has the story of a man who still denies he broke the law. Air America Radio with host Al Franken was founded five years ago by two businessmen from Guam. One of them was Evan Montvel Cohen. Later, he was accused of theft by a landscaper who trusted him as office manager. Don't be fooled by his clean-cut professional image that he portrays. He's nothing more than a thief, a con man. Air America Radio ended up being a spectacular failure. Just 18 months after he helped found the radio network, the prosecutor says Cohen was here in Hawaii where he wrote the three fraudulent checks. It was theft, and unfortunately, to this day, this defendant won't even acknowledge that. Montfield Cohen pleaded no contest and paid back about $30,000, and today asked that the felony not stay on his record. The shame, he says, was punishment enough. The toll on myself, on my wife, on my family, on the surrounding family has been uh, tremendous. And clearly, I, you know, my actions were unacceptable. The judge gave him five years probation and insisted that the felony stay on his record. I will re be rewarding such deceptive conduct. Air America didn't come up in court, but Montville Cohen had been criticized, even by Franken, for overstating his resources and using money from a nonprofit agency to fund the network. Outside the courtroom today, he insisted he is not a crook, despite his new felony record. I'll just uh, work harder and, and uh, have to prove myself even more. Reporting from Circuit Court, Daryl Huff, KITV4, Island Television News.